It is a beautiful morning, and I think what I want to do is go over to this farm and work on some peas again so that I can make some more glowstone. Whoops! I ran into the wall. Because I want to be able to start going out to the bluffs, and I think I need a good coat. And I have hardly any glowstones right now. I'm just going to leave my bike right there. Hello. Howdy. Hi. I'd like some work. Fantastic. I'll show you what needs to be done. It's not too complicated. Ten glowstones. I'm losing my inspiration. I have two left. Howdy. I might do this one more time. Need a few more glowstones, eh? Well, that's great news for me. Okay, I should be down to one inspiration right now. So, let's see how much that gave me. I have 21 right now. You know what I would really love to do is be able to go fishing and sell some fish, make money like that. So, I have a few commissions to work on. So I'm thinking what I want to do today is go fishing to make some glowstones and do a commission or two if I can. Now I have to paint a picture of a lonely tower. I was thinking about possibly doing the one that's just in the woods over here but that is a city tower and I don't think that's going to count. So let's get off the bike and pack it up. We're gonna go back to Lindau. Need a lift? I do. Let's go to Lindau. All right then. Here we are. The tower I want to try to paint is this lonely tower up on the hill. So let's get the bike back out. We'll get there a little quicker. I see a lot of things I need to pick here. This tower. I think this would be good against a stark sky. See how beautiful that is? Let's get off the bike. I'm just going to leave it there. And I want to paint this. Ooh, I think maybe from over here would be good? Yes, look at that. Okay. I have one inspiration left. I'm hoping that's going to be enough. Um... I think I might paint over this. Let's go with that. There we go. Lonely Towers completed. Wonderful. So we'll make some money from that. Let's see what the other ones were. Um, a Cobb House in the Country. I've got the Lonely Tower done, a natural arch, a starry cavern. I don't really know that I have any of those other ones I, that I know of that I could do right now. So instead of that, let's mount. Let's go find our pl a place to fish. I know that there is one where that one lady was standing near this other tower, the city tower. So we'll go there and see if I can catch some fish and sell them to the fishmonger in Navia, or Nava. There was a stick here too. Yep, I need that. There's some roots. Okay. This way. Okay. Let's leave the bike. Actually, let's pack it. I don't want to actually forget it by accident. I want to make enough money so that we can start heading off to the bluffs. That house over there, I wonder if that would be a commission. Ooh, I saw a fish. See if I can get up here. 
Oh, I can get up here. I didn't jump before. I want to try to take that picture, paint that right there. See if I have enough to make another canvas. Yes, two. Okay. Let's try to see if this works. Let's bring this in. Stretch it a little bit. Let's do that. Oh, I don't have enough inspiration. I ran out. Let's drink some tea. I have some somewhere, I think. Lindoian brew. There, that gave me enough, I believe. So let's try again. Oh, look how pretty that is going to be now. Because I drank that brew. Okay, adjust it in. Not like that. About like that. Up. Whoop. Let's try this. Okay, that didn't count apparently, but boy is that a pretty picture. Oh well. Okay, I want to fish. I see the fish. How do I fish? I guess I have to get my rod out. Oh, you have to put bait on there. Oh my gosh. Well, let's try the egg. I don't I don't know if that's going to work or not. How do we do this? Do you have to like toss it in or anything? That doesn't do anything. Oh. Okay. How the heck do I catch it? Did I miss the rush? Come on, little fishies. Okay. I think I'm getting close to being able to catch a fish, I hope. I don't know how to do it, though. I don't know if I hit the trigger. must have to be that I hit A. Well, fish got away. Was that a nibble? If it was, the fish got away. Okay. Well, let's try again. Got away again. I don't, I don't understand. Am I supposed to... Wow, I weren't really far out there. Am I supposed to do it when I see them go right at it? Like that? I got one! Okay. Well. Try again. Whoop. So it's like the longer you hold A, the further it goes. Look how nice and big that fish is. And it looks like you really have to, as soon as it hits that water and they it goes under. You gotta bring him in. Uh oh. Is it getting dark? Or is it. Oh, it's another. Beautiful. What's wrong here? Why can't I? Oh, I have to set more bait. Let's try that. That tuber that makes everybody sick. I don't know if it'll catch anything. Oh, got something. It looks like this whole area are these little ultramarine minnows. This is the only fish that I have seen so far. So I'm thinking that's the only fish that there is to catch. Look at that. Wow, that is so pretty. All right, how many fish did I catch then? Three, I think? Four. I should be able to sell these. So, 
Did I leave my bike up at the top of the steps? I think I did. Oh, I must have put it away. Okay. Let's get it out. Whoa! I didn't, didn't ever find anyone to tell about the, the hot air balloon either, so I don't know about that. That's kind of strange, unless it's not anyone here that I would tell, but I thought that it would be. Let's drop off the commission first. We're right here. Oh, pack this. Oh, dang it. Keep hitting the wrong thing. Pack this up. There we go. Hi. Welcome back. We've got plenty more patrons interested in your work. Well, I have a commission. The Lonely Tower. It's so pretty. Got another one for me, do you? I do. Let's see, what do we have? One more we can get. A windmill. I've only actu ever actually seen one in illustrations and I just love them. One day I'll make a trip to Tiffmore to see one in person. We're headed that way pretty soon. Okay, the fishmonger shop. The popper and the elk. Storytelling begins at 7 o'clock at the tarnished teapot. Hi! What crunchy scales. Scrumptious raw fish. <laughs> I can't wait until dinner time. You're so funny. You always want dinner. I have some fish to sell. Yay, look! Four each! I only have 36. I don't have a lot. And I'm up to 40, 44, 48, 52. Well, that is not bad for selling fish, is it? See, there's the other little kitty I saw. So cute! Okay. So, I need to make some more money. How many? I don't have any more inspiration. Let's drink another tea. Whoops, did I go past it? I did. Mystery blend. I wonder what this will do. Let's try. <gasps> Look at that. Wow. That would make for a really cool painting, wouldn't it? How cool. All right, did that give me any inspiration? It gave me some. Let's drink another tea. How did that do? I'm getting close to being inspired. I think I really need to just start traveling, I think. And I have my tent. Let's take a drink of water so I can get this off. How do I do that? Where's the water? There it is. There we go. We're back to normal. I think what I'm going to do is I don't have a coat, but I have a tent to sleep in at night and a campfire. I should be fine. It's 225. If we start on this journey, I think it's a good idea too right now. I just don't think I'm going to progress any further if I don't. So, I'm going to go out here and get on my bike. Where can I put my bike? Why can't I put my bike out? No. There. It just didn't give me the option, but I could put it out. As I see new places, I'll be able to get more inspiration. So, that's the plan. I'm going to go straight out this road that's out here. This little path and see what's out this way. This is going to take us towards the bluffs, I believe. I don't want to go too quickly on my bike though because I don't want to miss things. So I'm thinking for right now, I'm going to get off my bike. Maybe we'll use this when we're traveling between places we've already been to. 
I don't want to miss things because I would have missed that mushroom. I need to collect things as I'm going and look at this house. See, I could have gone rocketing right past this. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful view. <gasps> I know this view. Oh wow. I've been here before in leaving Lindau. I cannot stress enough how beautiful that game is and this game. Gorgeous. Let's take this. I want to come in here and speak with these people. Oh my gosh. This is so cool because Rania was Clara's best friend in leaving Lan Lan uh, Lindau. So she lives here now. This used to be a hideout we used to play at, so she added on and lives here now. Why, hello, friend! Glorious day, wouldn't you say? What an incredible day to be alive! It certainly is. Ah, I see you're a traveler, swept in from some distant land. How enchanting! Ah, oh, marvelous place, Eshade. The only trouble is, traveler, the little mice. The what? The little mice. You see, they've taken a liking to my garden. Not sure how they eat so much when I'm not looking. Must be bigger than I think. <laughs> I'm standing guard, but it's not working. Somehow they're getting past me. Must be while I'm sleeping. Not that I mind, really. I'm glad they have a proper meal. But how I dream of cooking up a proper stew. Vegetable, of course. Can't have a good stew without an assortment of the finest crops, eh? That sounds delicious. Tell you what, bring me seven sticks so I can finish my fence. That just may do the trick against these crafty carrot eaters. Of course, I never let a friend journey on without a few glowstones to pad their pocket. How's ten sound? That sounds great, and I've already got seven. Oh, isn't that perfect? I knew it was a good thing we met, Traveller. Of course, I appreciate your help. Nothing wrong with running around picking up sticks, just don't forget to get lost once in a while, eh? And look around you, smell the roses! That's right. I like taking my time. Oh, listen to me, I sound like an old timer! Not at all. What a fine one you are, polite as they come. You'll fit in splendidly in our little community here in Eastshade. Folk are as kind as can be. Anyhow, thanks for getting these sticks for me. It's a full-time job, standing guard. Why don't you come back in a day's time? That'll give me time to patch up this fence and see how it does against the little mice. See you soon. I'll definitely come back. Oh, I wonder if that's Rania down there. Are these the children? Aww. Look, they're having a game. I want to see the house. Ooh, I can brew some tea here too. That's really nice. That's a nice touch. <gasps> Hello. Hi there, stranger. It's Rania. Come on in. Care for some tea or maybe a mead? A tea would be lovely. Here you are then. Nothing like a refreshing cup. I don't think I've seen Wonderful. your face before. Are you from out west? I'm not from Eastshade. Ah, okay. I thought you might be from out west. I haven't met many westerners. I was born and raised in Nava. I really wish more westerners would come through this way. I really want to ask them about the drumming. Drumming? Have you heard the drums at night? Actually, I think I have, but I don't have that option. No, I haven't heard any drums. I was just a child the first time I heard the drumming out in the blush woods. My best friend and I used to play out here a lot. We even found a drum once. Wish I could look at that thing, but it seems to have disappeared. Ever since I moved out here, I've only heard the drumming late in the night. Some nights I hear it, others I don't. Doesn't seem to be any pattern. I like the music. It's captivating. In fact, it's almost bewitching. But I've always been bewildered as to its source. I figure it must be some westernly folk thing. 
Maybe the farmers from the Teethmore Bluffs throw parties in the Blushwood? Nobody in Nava seems to know anything about it. I don't know. What else can you tell me about Nava? That's where I grew up. My best friend and I spent a lot of time out here, though, running through the blush woods. There was an old shack right in this very spot that we used <laughs> as our hideout. Wasn't much more than a pile of boards back then, but I purchased the land and fixed it up. My son Finn brought his family out here, oh, too. He okay. always loved trees more than the bricks of the city. And I've got five beautiful grandchildren. Things couldn't be better. That's wonderful. Well, I'll see you later. How nice. I was hoping to find that lady that was on the boat with us out here. If I had ever found, you know, the old place. But she's not here, so I don't know. I'm thinking that was Clara, but maybe it wasn't. There's a little kitty. Green Book of Poetry. Ode to the Blushwoods. O oh, Blushwood Forest, gentle trails, we hiked along, our hearts unveiled. Her cheeks did match the firs above, as we sang a song of rosy love. A chipmunk heard our melody, so came to join us happily. O oh, tiny friend, come join our song, we'll dance and laugh the whole night long. But from his branch rained scores of nuts, he'd only wished to shut us up. <laughs> That's cute. I liked it. I've got one inspiration, which is nice, so if I find something I can paint, or that I want to paint, I can. I want to make some tea. I need to look at my book. I need more inspiration. So, the Lindoian tea is two white bloom sacks and roots. And then I can make the earth root tea, which is roots or two roots in an inky cap. Let's try both. So two of those, and I think it said one root, right? Yes. Perfect. Now let's do two roots in an inky cap. That was the earth root tea. Okay. Let's do some more. I need some tea for inspiration. I have all kinds of bloom sack. I feel like I should just make several of these. Use less roots. Because I'm not really sure what the earth one does, so go with this for a little bit. Okay, I'd say that's good for now. Made all kinds of tea. Thank you so much for letting me use your stove and taking your candle. Oh look, and some boards. Perfect. I'm glad I peeked back here. So all of these are her grandkids and this is her son working in the garden. That's great. So she is a granddaughter as well. Or is she maybe the wife? I bet she's the wife of Finn. Okay. What time is it now? 4.40. We're going to have to camp pretty soon. What a beautiful place. It would be nice to camp out here, wouldn't it? Let's keep going for a while. I want to see what else there is to see before it gets too dark. So we'll follow this path out. Oh, it goes two different ways. Let's see what this says. I can't remember from before where this went to. As I couldn't really go any further. Lindau is this way, it says. Let's see. I want to see where this comes out. <gasps> oh! Okay. So, oh, cool. I want to go that way probably too. So this comes to this big tree that I saw. We're just right on the opposite side of this big tree. Okay. Well, that's cool. Look, there's a house over there. 
I wonder how I get to that. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's that thistle I can't pick. There's a house there, too. Ooh, let's go this way. A water mill is the one. There's the, where I was fishing. Okay, so this was the house I took a picture of. Or a painting of. I'm always going to say that wrong. Five twenty-two. Pretty soon we've got to camp. Look at this. K and K apothecary. Well, look at this. And they have a kitty on the table. Perfect. Hi. Welcome to K and K apothecary, the finest source for all your medicinal tincture needs. If you hear of anyone looking for an apothecary, send them our way. Oh, really? Just send anyone our way. It's been so long since we've had a single customer. I'm sorry to hear that. Hi there. We've got the best herbs and potions in all of Eastshade. <laughs> Tell your family, your friends, and uh, random acquaintances to come here for all their apothecary needs. I'll do that. There's a little kitty there. Well, I like your apothecary. I can't buy Welcome anything, can I? Welcome to apothecary. No. Nope. Oh, really? Just send anyone our way. Okay, I can't. It's we'll just so keep going. Had a single customer. Oh, so pretty. I'm hoping over here I can put a tent out. I'm thinking that I'll be okay right in this area. Look at that. I wonder if there's a way to get over there. I don't know if I can just walk across. What time is it? It's about six. It looks like we should be able to get over there somehow. Maybe a bridge over there. But we need to rest for the night. It's going to get really cold really fast. So, where's my tent? There we go. Let's go to bed. Alright, pack it up. I'm gonna go this way because I see like a bridge or something over there. And I think we can get across. There's something. Oh, good, more roots. Perfect. I feel like I'm getting further away from where I want to go. So, do I need to just cut through here? I love these trees so much. They're so pretty. There's a path that way. I wonder if it met up down here somewhere, maybe. Right here could be. I'm not sure. On the lake. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh, there's some people over here. Look at the house over there! Oh wow. Goodness! I didn't even know that existed! How pretty! Hi there! Beautiful place to come and think, wouldn't you say? It's very nice here. This place will always be closest to my heart. My husband liked to come out here and fish. We spent many nights camping here in the Blushwood. But now old Pops is doing his best to tarnish my fond memories. Old Pops? Old Pops is a fish! The biggest fish in the lake! What did this fish do to you? <laughs> what didn't he do? This fish has haunted my dreams for... Oh, what seems like ages. Old Pops, that evil fish. He has it out for me, I'll have you know. I was out on the boat with my husband, Farid, an anniversary camping trip, when old Pops leaps out of the water and snatches my wedding ring right off of my finger. Oh no. Are you sure that's what happened? It's not the first time he's pulled something like this. 
He's taking glowstones and bracelets. Uh, sneakiest thief on the islands, that fish is. Old Pops only eats valuables? Well, some of those folks might be trying to cover up the fact they misplaced their precious items. It's easy to blame it on a fish. But he really did eat my ring! People round here talk about Old Pops like he's some sort of magical fish with healing properties or some nonsense. Hmm. They say when you stare Old Pop straight in the eye, he conjures an image of what you want most in this world and makes that thing seem real to you, as real as day. Say, what would Old Pops make you think of? What do you treasure most? Adventure? Painting? Oh, wow. I like adventure. I also like art. But I'd have to say... Adventure. I've never gone on much of an adventure. I suppose my grandest adventures have been camping out here with my ferret. That's enough reflecting for the time being. You and I, people of action. I don't suppose you'd be willing to help me get my wedding ring back. Are you sure it's safe? Of course, of course. He's a big old fish, but you're strong. Will you get that ring for me? I can try. Excellent, excellent! Old Pops, better watch out! Our new traveler friend is a-coming for ya! You got a fishing pole? You're not gonna be catching Old Pops without one. Maybe not even with one, that floundering foe. I don't know too much about him, other than he's a big one. Betting he's a sandfish by the size of him. You stay careful round old Pops, you hear? He has it out for us. Especially boaters and fisher folk. She's not making me really want to fish. <laughs> I see fish out there. I wonder if this is where I need to try to fish. Well, let's try to fish a few times at least. Alright, let's do that egg. Okay, here we go. Did I go far enough out? Let's try again. Not sure. I'm really getting out there enough. Keep going. Let's go a little further. As far as I could go, it bounced back a little, though. Nobody seems to be biting right now. As far as I can go, it's right there. I wonder how you get out to that house over there. Okay, well, nobody's biting right now. What's that? Nothing. Okay. So what I want to do is continue on my way, trying to get to the other side here. Because I want to see if I can get across that bridge I saw. And see what's on that other little patch of land there. I know that there was a water mill, so I want to see that. Wow, this is so cool. I wonder what that is, too. Alright, I'm here. Let's look. Well, look at that. Only thing I could think is that would be perfect to have the moon rested in there and take a picture or a painting of it. Wouldn't that be cool? Wonder how you get over there, huh? Oh, look, there's a, a tower and someone working on it over there. How do we get over there? For some reason, I don't think that was a bridge I was seeing. Sinkwood Falls. Well, that wasn't a bridge I was seeing. 
It's over there. Interesting. I'm sure there's no way to get over there either. But let's continue this way and see. Might get lucky, I don't know. The little mice. Oh, okay, so he's got his place, his fence up. We can go back and see him because it looks like I'm not going to be able to go anywhere over here right now. We definitely want to get over there, and I don't know how to do it. Let's look at the map while we're here. So, I don't even know where I am in relation to this. It does not tell me anything. I'm, I'm th between, I'd say, her house and her house. Probably closer to Blushwood Forest. I don't know how to get there. There has to be a way to get over there, but right now I'm not figuring that out, so I'm going to go back to Ranya's house and see the fence, and then I'll figure out where I need to go to get over there. I don't even think it's as easy as this. I think it's going to be too deep. Look at the fish! We can fish! There's more fish. How cool. Okay, well, we'll do that sometime. Right now, we're going back to Rania's house. I have a Patreon page. If you like my videos and want to help support my work, consider becoming one of my patrons on Patreon. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video.